Hey guys, it's been a little bit. Um, I've been really busy and I actually got sick for a little while, so it's been a while. Um, I did make it out to the Dollar Tree the other day. And so uh, this is my Dollar Tree haul for today. And here's Jasper again. <laughs> um, I got a few fun things and I also got some, you know, just food items like always. And I'm just gonna go ahead and get um, socks first. So I got these, and then they have the cute little, um, you know, the little non-skid type things on them. I saw they were unique looking, just kind of a different color than normal. And I just always use socks, and I like socks, so I picked those out. And then these are also, they're ankle socks, but they're the thicker version. And it's a llama. I don't know if you can see that very well. That wasn't planning on being one-handed. So that's a llama there. And again, just kind of a different little color. Usually, you know, you see pink, blue, but you don't normally see the peaches and the teals like this. So I thought those were really cool. Um, I think that's about it for clothing. And then I picked up, I hit the stationery and I went crazy in the stationery section. I picked these up, these pens. They're just, um, I've always just liked these thicker, fatter pens. And I've gotten these before and I like them and I just went ahead and picked up a few more. So they're just nice to keep at the office. Um, I picked up some more washies. These are the deco tape. These are the skinnier ones. I like to use these in my planner, but these are just really pretty and I liked them because um, a little more fall colors. And I have way too many washies already, but you know what? I use them and I like them. So here's another blues. Um, and I didn't have any of these at all. Uh, so I thought I'd pick these up. And then I saw these cactus ones. Isn't that cool? And I'm from Arizona, so perfect. These are really cute. My friend picked these up and she made a really cute um, bookmark, actually, with um, some of the washi and then a stamp set that she had. And then here's... Um, I don't know. It's just like a design, kind of like an abstract design. Sorry for the glare. But that's really pretty. And it's just kind of throughout the same kind of idea. I think that's it for the washi. I picked this up for the fall. I just thought they were really pretty. They're really big leaves and they do have the alligator claw clips. I think I had shown them to you in a walkthrough before, and I didn't pick them up that day, but then I went ahead and picked them up this time. So. And I picked this little guy up. He's a little shelf sitter. He's just super cute. Little owl. And then he's got the little sunflower on the top of his head. His hat, I'm sorry. And he's got holding the pumpkin in the back. That's the back of him. I just think he's cute. Just a cute little guy. And then the other thing I did find that was cool... I'm just going to put out in the yard somewhere is this little witch. She appears to be flying over the moon or whatever, but she is solar power. So I'm just going to stick her out in the yard at the end of the, I don't know, probably the end of the driveway or something or right near where I'm probably going to go ahead and do trick or treating. I usually just sit out there because otherwise I'm in the house and it's just constant knocking and ringing at the bell at the door. So I just, I prefer to just sit out there for a while usually a few hours and then I'll come back in. And I usually, you know, at that point I'm done. Oh, uh, let's see. Stationery. Oh, here's another little fall thing. These are cute too. And they're little um, clothespins. Oh, one more thing. Acorns, just from Table Scatter. I think I'd hauled these before, but I just thought they were pretty and they remind me of just growing up, we used to um, go out and pick acorns and stuff, and these just remind me of that from back then, back in the day. Um, I also did pick up some Christmas. I know I told you guys I wouldn't, but these are the type of things that just disappear right away. And as you all know, I make cards, I do scrapbooking, and I do planners. So these are perfect for that. Um, they also had silver ones in there, but I just picked up the blue for now. And if I see the silver again, I will. And the blue, I don't know if it comes out. It doesn't, I think it looks darker in the camera. But this is more like an aqua, like a teal. It's not really blue 
as blue as it's coming up on camera, but they're really pretty. Um, I picked up another notebook because you know I don't have enough notebooks already. And it just says, begin each day with a grateful heart. And I did pick up stickers. These I just thought were super cute, just happy birthday banners. I just thought it was cute. It's a nice little birthday, maybe for a younger, younger child. And I finally, finally found some of the Crafter Square stickers that people had been hauling. So I did pick up the snails. I just love these, they're so pretty. And again, I just do the cards and the um, planner stuff. Birds. Trees. That one right there in the middle kind of reminds me of a lollipop tree. It's just kind of cool. <clears throat> Elephants. Aren't they cute? And then the giraffes, I just could not, there was no way I was going to leave those behind. And because I do like them so much, I did pick up two of those. They're just so cute. And if I see them again, I'll probably pick them up again. These, I'm not really a, a drinker as, much, as far as wine goes or the alcohol, but I do like the coffees in here. So I got them mainly for the coffees and the drinks, you know, like these ones here. And then like the iced tea and stuff. But mainly the coffees. I'm obviously a coffee drinker. And then this is just kind of a kitchen one. It's kind of, I don't know, it reminds me kind of like a 50s style kitchen in a way. It's just cute. And then I did get the food one as well. I got the donuts and the ice cream, the popsicle. And this says, enjoy this sweet moment. And I also picked up the food ones, which is the burger and another donut, it looks like. A pretzel, not sure, I guess that's a sandwich of some sort, I don't know. And then pizza, tacos, some desserts down there at the bottom, and some popcorn and soda. So it's just super cute, I like that. I think that's it as far as stationery, and I'm going to go ahead and move on to the food items, because, you know, I always pick up snacks and that sort of thing. I also picked up a little bit of Halloween, but some of it we already got into. Um, I got some little six let six set six lets. These are good. I like these. They're um those little guys there. They're like chocolate. They're um candy covered chocolate basically. I picked these up because they're just fun for the kids. They're um they paint your tongue black, and they're lollipops basically with um this these do have bubble gum in them. And then speaking of gum, I did pick these up, this extra watermelon. My son likes gum, um, so I get it for him, but I also like it too. So I just got that. I got some sugar-free hard candy. I don't know how good it's going to be, but I thought the um, choices were pretty interesting. It's chocolate, chocolate raspberry, chocolate mint, and Swiss chocolate almond. And again, these are sugar-free, so I can keep them at my desk, and I'm not, I don't feel like I'm, um, you know, cheating as much as and it's sugar-free with Splenda in it. So Splenda is a little bit safer, supposedly. So, I mean, Stevia is probably the best, but still, I'm not really supposed to have that anyway. Uh, sweet Tart Ropes, which is kind of a staple, and when he, pretty much any time I go to <laughs> Dollar Tree, I like to pick those up. My son really likes them. My friend likes them. So even if I don't have any, um, I there's somebody that always finds some, you know, something to do with them or eats them or shares them with people. Um, this is another little munch mix that I'd gotten before. And I think I'd already stated that I like to put these into, um, yogurt sometimes like my Greek yogurts, whenever I have those, I haven't been eating those very much just because I am trying to do more low carb, but, um, my son also likes these and he likes them on his ice cream. So anyway, and then this is just a little, um, it says two servings, but I've already said that we can get like four or five servings out of this because it's really just to kind of sprinkle over things. And it has coconut chips, um, yogurt raisins, and peanuts. And in case anyone wants to know, the carb count on this is 12 grams if you eat just, if you eat the whole half bag. So it's not that bad um, because, again, I don't eat the whole bag. <laughs> so... 
I did pick up mashed potatoes, Idaho and mashed potatoes. I get these all the time. Uh, it just makes it easier for my son. He just kind of puts it all together when he's making his dinners on Thursdays. He likes mashed potatoes and my son, my husband does too. So they, they eat these a lot. Um, it's just easier. And then I did pick this up as well. Haribo Star Mix. Just a gummy candy. These are just kind of a mixture of all of the Haribo, basically. So I see snakes in here. I see Cokes, uh, like little Coke bottle things. It's just a huge mixture. Um, gummy bears, rings, just different things I see in there. Um, I also picked up these Snaps pretzels. I just feel better about him eating things like this versus like, you know, this kind of stuff. But I did pick this up too. Um, he likes this one. Sour cream and onion, my son. And my husband likes this. And the one that just dropped was actually empty. They had already gotten into a, oh, it's a cheddar one. <laughs> so I'm just going to probably put that in the recycle. But I did get it this last trip. And then last, but, but not least really, is this. I just picked these plates up. It's cast a spell and there's an 18 count in here of plates. Um, we just like to use them for our snacks and that sort of thing. I, I think I've already um, said that I, I like to do that and because it is Halloween it's just kind of a nice nice change to just have something more festive and just you know seasonal. So even in the summer I'll pick up like watermelon ones or whatever. So I think that's it for my haul, guys, and sorry I look a hot mess, but I've been home for a little while. I was trying to descale my coffee pot, took all the makeup off and everything, and I thought, you know what, I need to get this haul done because the boys are going to start getting into all these snacks and I'm not going to have anything to haul. So that's it for my haul. I have been um, doing okay. I, it's just, I've just been crazy, and um, I was sick a while back, so that's part of the reason why I was out uh, for a while, but I'll be back. I do have a Plum Deluxe um, to share with you guys in a little bit. This is that tea subscription. If no one's seen me do this before, you might want to check out my other videos. I do a subs I do have a subscription for tea, so I'll show you that later on. So that's it for today, and I hope you all are having a good day and have a good week as well, and talk to you soon. Bye!